So the background to all of this and why are we going, why are we going after Primark is it's been fairly well documented since about 2007 that there have been instances of male sexual violence against women and girls in Primark stores and in Primark changing rooms. Um, so in March 2022, an ex-Metropolitan policeman was convicted of voyeurism having filmed a woman getting changed in the Wandsworth uh, store. Um, he put his phone under the gap at the bottom of, of the changing cubicle that she was using. So he was given a suspended sentence. He's on the sex offenders register for 10 years. He is subject to a uh, sexual notification requirement for 10 years, which, believe, which includes that he cannot use a, use a mixed sex changing room for a decade. But what was more worrying, I think, with the trend of some of these men is that it then gets found what else they've been doing. This individual had extreme pornography at home, um, showing you know, pretty extreme images of, of children and animals. So for many of these men, the voyeurism that they're doing in or undertaking when they're in Primark changing rooms is kind of the tip of the iceberg. Um, so Primark, I mean, one of the other things that happened just to quickly share with you was a security guard who was working for Primark. He was employed by somebody else. He used his knowledge of CCTV blind spots to basically sexually assault four 15 year olds in the store and to rape a young girl um, who he had caught shoplifting. So Primark are well aware of the lengths that predatory men go to to access um, women and girls, whether that's in their stores or in their um, changing rooms. I mean, in I think December of last year, our Crown, Prosecu our Crown Prosecution Service issued some statistics that showed that shops, particularly supermarkets, so not necessarily Primark, are responsible for about 36% of voyeurism prosecutions in this country. So it is a serious problem. But Primark basically haven't really done anything. I've been into Primark stores in uh, as it so happens, uh, England and Wales over the last week, I've had a friend in Scotland and very few changes have been made. So this kind of all came to a little bit of a head, for want of a better word, of word in, in September. A young woman um, posted a film on TikTok. She was sitting in her car and she was in tears, having just been harassed by two men in a larger group in the Cambridge mixed sex changing room. Now, this young woman is might not feel that I speak for her. I'm not claiming to because she loves inclusivity, um, which I think is what we're teaching our young women to, to budge up. But she basically said, you know, if you go into a changing room, try not to go alone. I won't ever be doing that again and stay safe. And I think for me, I just I'd had enough by then. I've, I've asked very nicely um, retailers that I've worked with if we could talk about single sex spaces and all you ever get is silenced and told that you're being hateful. So what Primark then have said they were doing is they provide a dedicated woman only changing area. So everybody got really excited. Why wouldn't we? Till they confirm that by women they mean men who say they're women um so their signs are very misleading i went into one primark earlier this week in the county that i live in and spoke to one of the shop floor staff who basically said well if a man wears a dress he will be allowed in um primark won't answer how they're going to stop predatory men accessing spaces where women and girls of all ages will be in various states of undress, um, you know, trying their clothes on. They are trusting, and these are their words, they are trusting customers to make the right, you know, to choose the right changing room. So, you know, I think certainly from the women that I'm speaking to, it doesn't feel good enough. 
Primark have known for a long time um, that this is an issue. Our legislation, the Equality Act 2010, absolutely allows for single sex spaces, um, but they are digging their heels in in terms of reinstating them. 